Hey, what's up everybody? Monday, yeah, January 6th. It is Monday, so the new edition of MMT Trader has been sent out. If you want to get that, go to my website, pitbulleconomics.com, and sign up for a 30-day free trial. All right, a lot of stuff going on, folks. A lot of stuff going on. We had uh, two weeks now of some very interesting banking data. As you know, at the end of 2018, a little over a year ago, uh, November and December of 2018, the market was crashing. Everybody was panicking. I had a lot of subscribers. They, you know, they, they needed those adult diapers. Um, but I said, you got to buy, you got to buy, you got to buy. We had a fantastic year in 2019. Now, why did I say that? I mean, a couple of things at that time that I spoke about was the expansion in bank credit, the acceleration in loans and leases, um, the um, strong demand figures for petroleum. This sort of stuff was giving me uh, sort of a barometer or a pulse on economic activity when everybody was panicking because of the so-called trade war and the headlines, they were trading headlines. I had people saying, oh, what do I need? you know, to understand MMT or what do I need your service for? I could just trade the headlines. Okay, yeah, that's it. That's all you got to do, right? Folks, it's 2020 now, and as I just alluded to, some interesting things in the banking data, interesting things in oil markets, and I'm not just talking about the Soleimani killing and the geopolitical headlines. Look, those things are unknowable unless you are inside the White House, you know, close to Trump. I mean, those things are unknowable. I do not rest on uh, ever being on the inside or having that information. I look at economic conditions because ultimately that is the decider of everything. Now, I'm not saying that something geopolitical can't change economic conditions, we know that it can. But when we see that, there is time to react. I mean, the reaction doesn't come in an instant. I mean, you might get a reflex reaction in an instant, and oftentimes that reflex reaction is wrong. We know this because the vast majority of investors and traders, they react emotionally, they have no mental game, they have no understanding if it's if it's a policy uh, thing. They have no understanding of how policy affects uh, economies. If it's purely a geopolitical thing, they probably get that wrong as well, or they do what everybody else does. Case in point, you know, look at oil today. It was down, right? Came in over the weekend. I saw things, people posting up things on Twitter and every other place. Oh, it's going to open, it's going to gap open $5 higher. No, it opened like 80 cents higher. It ran up like, uh, I don't know, a buck and a half or buck 20, buck 40, and now it closed down on the day. I'm actually short oil. And we saw in the EIA inventory, uh, the EIA uh, petroleum report last week, which of course I do a deep, deep analysis on that. It's not just about inventories, all right? It's about demand, it's about imports, it's about exports, it's about production. You have to be able to synthesize all that information, which is what I do. So, and everybody, by the way, everybody needs to have a big picture macro perspective. I mean, if you have that, then basically that's like having a road map. That's like having a GPS system that tells you, you know, where you want to go. From that, you can distill down into strategy. If it's stocks are your thing, you can look at the broad market, then you could even break that down into um, sectors of the market. If commodities are your thing, same thing. You could understand where the macro picture is going to drive commodities. Is it inflationary? Is it deflationary? Bonds, same thing. Forex, same thing. You have to have the macro picture. It's very, very important. Now, folks, what's it going to be for 2020? I mean, you've been following me here for a long time. I mean, it's all about pulling the trigger. And it's all about releasing yourself from this false notion that there's some magical system out there that's going to take you to where you want to go. It's about developing the skills and the experience and the mental game 
to make your success happen for you. I mean, it's there. It's there for you to take if you so desire. Decide. And it also means commitment. You have to make a commitment. And there are going to be times within that commitment that you made where you are going to be tested, where that commitment is going to be tested. And it will be tested to the core, believe me, a lot and often. And when that happens, you have to be willing to recommit. That's why so many people are unable to reach their goal and be consistent as traders and investors when it comes to being profitable and generating the kind of wealth and capital that they want or that they think they want. That, that's a whole other thing, right? I've spoken about that, that a lot of people come into this game thinking, oh, they want, they want success and they want money and they want that freedom that comes with being able to trade from anywhere. But that's not really what they want. What they really want is action. They're looking for action. They're impatient. They don't want to wait. And that stems from a lack of maturity. That stems from a, a perception of, you know, like uh, feeling grandiose, like too important, self-importance, inflated self-importance, like I'm too important to have to wait. I want it now. I want the market to move in my direction now. I want that money now. I want those profits now. 2020 is your year if you decide. And I'm here to make it happen, to help make it happen for you. It's about the correct understanding. It's about the correct information. It's about knowledge. And it's about developing that mental game where the outcome is in your hands every single time. It's not about a headline. It's not about some external factor. It's not about what the Fed does. You control the outcome. You control the outcome every single time. Now, I don't know anybody who would not want to be in that situation, but <laughs> interestingly enough, a lot of you choose to be in that situation. You don't think it's a choice. You think it's something external. You think it's the market. You think the, the Fed did something. You think... Uh, uh, Trump tweeted something and that blew out your position, but no. Everybody's outcome is within their own determination. Self-determination. You got to make a commitment. You got to go for it. You got to understand where the success comes from. It doesn't come from a magical system. It doesn't even come really from... Um, a deep, deep understanding of economics, although what we have in our understanding clearly gives us an advantage, gives us a massive advantage, all right? But that doesn't mean necessarily that the gains come instantaneously, not even sometimes that they come quickly. You got to wait. You got to wait. But it's all attainable. That's the thing. You have to choose to want it. I mean, some people might think they want it, but they're not willing to put in the effort, the sacrifice, and the commitment, really. It's what it boils down to is a commitment. So I'm here, ready to help you guys out anytime you want. Let's do it. 2020, make the commitment. Go to the website, pitbulleconomics.com. Sign up for a 30-day free trial of MMT Trader. I'm the only one... I mean, I've said this a million times, and I'm going to say it a million more times. I'm the only one who has an applied approach to MMT. I take the concepts and understandings of MMT, and I apply them to trading and investing. Nobody else does that. A lot of MMT academics out there, and they're writing papers. And by the way, a lot of them get a lot of stuff wrong. A lot, and I'm talking about even the top people in MMT. All right? There's been no, if, uh, from what I can see, understanding about um, reserve flows and how they have an effect on bank credit under the regulatory regime that we have in place right now. Very important because it drives markets and it also drives economic activity. Nothing. They dismiss that. That's wrong. That is, that, that is an omission that is... In my opinion, inexcusable. It's not a full understanding of the monetary system when you omit that. I talk about that. I've been talking about that. I've explained that. 
so many times. All right, folks, get the new edition of MMT Trader. Go to pitbulleconomics.com and sign up for a 30-day free trial. Go to my website right now and do it. Um, all right, talk to everybody tomorrow. Bye-bye.